Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new here. Today I'm going to be showing you how I made Sands from Undertale into a cake topper. So here we go. I'm going to be building him on a cake dummy that I've inserted two skewers into, and that will be my support. I'm taking some modelling paste and I'm going to start by making the legs. I leave the foot and then keep on rolling and extending out the leg with my fingers. And once I'm happy with it, I can push a cocktail stick through the center. And this will just make it easier for me to thread it onto the skewer, like so. I do two legs. I just have a play about with the positioning. I add an extra piece of modeling paste to the very top of the legs as well. And this is just gonna support the shorts when I add them. I'm rolling out a small thin piece of black modeling paste that I can then wrap around him. I cut away any excess at the back and then I score in the lines for the shorts. Next, I move on to the body. I'm using white modelling paste, keeping it very basic. I just need to make sure that it fits nicely on top of those legs and I make sure to give him a good push to make sure he's nice and stuck in place. The jacket, I'm rolling out a thin rectangle of blue modelling paste and I use a bit of water to help hold it in place and then wrap it around him. I use my knife to knead up the ends. It's important to make sure that your knife is sharp for things like this, or it's just gonna end up dragging the modeling paste with it. I use my sculpting tool to create little pockets because I want his hands in his pockets. His arms are super basic. I roll out a cord of more of that blue modeling paste and I'm just gonna keep it thinner at one end. And then I just bend in an elbow and then attaching it, it was a bit difficult with the hands in the pockets. It took me a while to get it so that it looked like it was in a natural position. I do a little blending on the shoulders. For his head, again, nice and basic, I've got a ball of white modelling paste and I'm going to push in a slight dint into both sides. And then I'm going to push in the eyes, the nose and the mouth using various sculpting tools. I add a tiny bit of black into the eye sockets and the nose as well. And then two tiny balls of white into the eyes. He has a gray collar on his jacket or is a collar or a hood, I don't know. Anyway, I rolled out a cord of gray and keep it thinner at both ends. And then once it's stuck in place, I run my sculpting tool along it to create a fold. Right, I need to give him slippers. Why does he wear slippers? If you know, let me know. I also add the little strips to his shorts as well, just grey and white modelling paste. 
And then finally, I just go over him with some dry rainbow dust. This just helps to give him a little bit more depth, especially on his face. It will help bring out them features. And there he is. If there are any other characters you want to see me make on this channel, please let me know in the comments and please come back next week for a completely different tutorial. And as always, please subscribe to this channel. Thanks guys, bye.